tie off your arm and you go to heaven. You can really hear it in the lyrics here uh, that they're talking about drug use, obviously. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a good one today. I'm the Metal Junkie and today I'm returning to Wasp with the song Thunderhead. Um, this one should be interesting. It's off the album The Headless Children, which I've been going through. Uh, track number four and yeah never heard of it before it's almost seven minutes long so we're gonna jump right in without missing a beat Pianos are sound so good. I just want to mention the background. The, oh, it's kind of reminding me of Halo. <laughs> you know, the intro for Halo, uh, the video game. But yeah, so far so good. Uh, interesting that we're getting a close up of the album cover here so I can really see who's on there. You can see Hitler. You can see uh, Charles Manson. So a bunch of bad people on this cover. And finally, I just want to say I hear a little bit of crackling on this track. And I just noticed it says vinyl digitizing. So I'm guessing this was taken from a vinyl. That's why you get that sound. But it's not, it doesn't bother me all that much. Beautiful. powerful drumming in this one the drums are really sticking out uh by frankie benali great 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 drum work in here and uh when i what i read real quick it said something about when i clicked on the song uh one of the top comments said that it was about uh drug use specifically heroin and uh yeah the how uh awful it is to be a heroin addict you know um uh, it's not their fault obviously they can't help themselves once they're addicted and it's not just that struggle, but to watch somebody take heroin, how bad that is as well. And I caught a few of the lyrics here. I couldn't find a lyric video, unfortunately. But uh, I heard them say, like, it's worse than the venom from a snake, like worse poison than that. So I'm, I'm picking up the pieces of what they're uh, what they're talking about here because uh, it is you're poisoning yourself. Right. It's a it's unfortunate. And it said there, a gunshot to the head would be quicker way to die, basically.
end of every verse or even every line in a verse, the drummer's always do 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 do. He's always doing those fills. I freaking love it. And yeah, you uh tie off your arm and you go to heaven. You can really hear it in the lyrics here uh that they're talking about drug use obviously. Thunderhead. Interesting name for a track like this. Uh let's keep her going. feel like uh blackly law blackie lawless the vocalist here i feel like he had such a perfect voice for this 80s type of hair metal like it's not really hair metal it's a little darker than that but you know he has that perfect voice it can go long and high but it has a certain raspiness to it to give you that like little bit of edge perfect vocalist for this type of music in my opinion watch out, watch out. like there's definitely two lead guitars in here or they're doing some things in studio because you could hear like the overlapping tapping and everything but it could be just the two guitars going back and forth uh i was gonna say short-lived solo but then it kind of kept going uh, through that interlude i didn't i didn't expect it to that was really cool and it came back with a vengeance the drumming again during that whole section was just going off it had to really keep the backbone of the song right going it's the drums are always very important but i feel like it's even more important in this track and that whole little interlude solo thing we just got i felt like would be perfect to see live like you know you can really get the crowd interaction going in that section let's wrap this up
that was Thunderhead by Wasp. And what a track. Oh, we got that great section in the two-thirds mark that really kind of blew me away. These guitars are no joke. Neither is the drummer. Neither is all of them. The bass, the freaking Black is Lawless on vocals. He has such a powerful voice for this type of music and all around great track about a very uh, serious issue, you know, that uh, a lot of bands had in the 80s. Uh, heroin is not as big of a issue in today's modern day music. It still gets used, but not nearly as often as before. Uh, back then, a lot of the problem was management, right? They were getting you hooked on it and basically controlling you and taking all your profit. That's what happened to a lot of these bands. But uh, yeah, it's a, it's a really tough subject. And uh, I'm just glad that they tackled it with such supreme force. Great, great track overall. Not a dull moment to be found. Great intro that really built up into this heavy hitting track. So that was Thunderhead by Wasp. Track number four. Up next is Mean Man. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching.